it's Julie Davison from juliedavison.com. I've got a real fun video for you today. I am showcasing all of the celebration favorites before they're gone. It's hard to believe that celebration is almost over. Celebration ends August 31st, 2022, which is next Wednesday and less than a week away. So if you haven't gotten all of your favorite goodies from celebration, make sure you get shopping in my online store at juliedavison.com slash shop. Check the video description for the current host code. If you order less than $150, you want to use that host code so you can get my free gift and bonus kit that I'll be working on for August. Well, today I'm going to keep it real short and sweet because I'm actually traveling for the Stampin' Up! Backstage Conference. I didn't want to not give you a video, but I don't have any new projects to share today. I'm going to review all of the celebration gift options and share a few project samples with each one. Hopefully I will inspire you with the 25 celebration cards that I'm sharing today. And I'll be back again with a live video, a live premiere on Sunday with mom, Sunday stamping. And then we've got um, our live class for the Ringed with Nature that's happening on Tuesday, August 30th at 7 p.m. Central Time. I just posted the PDF for this. So the PDF is the same thing, tiny URL, and then it's August 2022 PDF. Really easy to remember. So if you're interested in just getting the tutorials, um, then you can get that on my Etsy shop. Or if you want to get a card kit, you can still reserve that and we'll get it mailed out to you. So I'm looking forward to stamping with you um, next week. I have a sneak peek to share with you, but we're going to go in order of the celebration brochure. So we're going to just open it up and get right started. The very first thing in the celebration brochure sure is those cutest hippos. There is a hippest hippos stamp set in the hippo dies. You can get each one for free with a $50 order or both free with a $100 order. These are so cute. And just one example of some of the exclusive products that we have during celebration. So if you love these hippos, you're not going to see them again. <laughs> you're definitely going to want to make sure that you get the hippo steam set and the hippo dies right away so that you don't miss out. Oh my goodness. Here's a card from Gwen Duckworth. I just love that cute little tub that the hippo's in and the little ribbon towel. Some of these I've shared before, so I'm not going to dwell too much. Here's one from Carol Norquist. I love the little die cuts here from the hippo dies with the sunglasses and the waves and the boat. Just the stinking cutest. Last one here with our ballerina. This is showcasing several different celebration products. We have the new dots and spots. This is something that Stampin' Up! added in August. Some additional celebration items that you can get. Also some of the silver foil, which you can find right here, is a new celebration gift. And then the silver and gold designer paper in the background. Love the way that turned out. I shared that just recently. Um, moving right along in our celebration book, the next item is that Rings of Love designer paper. This paper is so gorgeous. There's a pattern for every season. In fact, you may have seen I shared a calendar on Tuesday during the Great Day card swap. I used a different pattern from the Rings of Love for every month of the year. There's 12 different patterns, so a different pattern every month to feature <laughs> the calendar. Isn't this just awesome? I love the way this turned out. I updated my calendar template for 2023, and you can find that in my Etsy shop. I'll have the link in the video description. It's a printable calendar on white cardstock. Well, I would print it on white cardstock. You can print it on vanilla or any color that you'd like. So I printed it on white cardstock, and then I used the stitched rectangle dies to die cut and put it onto the designer paper. Punch some holes in the top. These are one and a quarter inch binder rings, and then this is a pedestal frame that I got from Ikea a few years ago. I have just a couple in my stash that I'm using personally, but if you go on Amazon and search for pedestal frame, you can find um, some. I think there's a new style at Ikea that might work, but I haven't tried it, so I don't want to promise anything. This is just such a fun gift to create and give at Christmas time. So I use the Rings of Love designer paper for that. I have a few other projects to share with you. Here's one. The Hey, I Miss You is from Amazing Phrasing. So I'm going to 
I'm going to pull that back out and show you when we get to that page. But the designer paper in the background is that acorn and fall leaves. I just love the colors there. Here's one I created just last week, the little double flap card featuring that designer paper where you can see both sides. I always love that. The rings ringed with nature bundle includes the tree rings hybrid folder that has um, the beautiful detail with the embossing. And then this is stamped and die cut as part of that um, part of that bundle, the ringed with nature. I just love the way that one turned out. And you might recognize this one as well, the envelope flap card. Um, created using that Rings of Love um, poinsettia paper, and it just kind of tucks underneath that banner. I'll put links in the video description to all these videos, so if you haven't seen them yet, you can check out um, the links and catch up on what you've missed. Here's one that I created for a swap um, for my team. We did a little, I did a little um, tree ring embossing folder in the background and just showing off that awesome um, bird paper. I just love that pattern. I think it might be my favorite from the Rings of Love. Last one, this is a sneak peek of the class. This is one of the five cards that we'll be making in that Ringed with Nature class. The Get Well Soon features imagery from the Ringed with Nature stamp set and then that beautiful flower paper from the Rings of Love designer paper. You guys are going to love the cards. I cannot wait to share them all with you on Tuesday. Moving right along, the next one is those pool party cards and envelopes, and you probably know they've been sold out um, for about a month or so. So the next one that is still available is the Stylish Sketches. I was having some fun casing the catalog. Can you tell my inspiration there? So this one is the bottom one, just with the He's the Man designer paper, using watercolor pencils on both of these cards. And this one loosely cases the layout there with the hexagons. I used a direct to ink, or direct to paper uh, technique with the ink pad to create the background of this card. I like the way that turned out. Beautiful shapes is where the hexagon dies come from. I got a few swaps I'm gonna show you too. Again, I think I've shown these before. This one is from Deb Snyder. And this one from Don Olszewski. What do you guys think about that stylus sketches? It took me a little while to warm up to it with the fox and the fig and the ducks. Um, but I really like the masculine cards that I've created. Next up is the silver and gold 6x6 six six designer paper. I love this. It is so, so versatile. There's dots and stripes silver and gold. Here are some cards that I made where I stamped on that um, designer paper. I love the way that turned out. This is using the Texture Chic, the Season of Chic um, stamp set and then some Orchid Oasis, Balmy Blue, uh, Calypso Coral, and Pale Papaya. I really love this clean and simple layout. I think those turned out really nicely. Here's a swap card that I got. This one is from Natalie Travis using the blending brushes to color on this paper. I love that you have that opportunity to customize the paper, whether you're using blending brushes or Stampin' Blends and creating additional lines to create a plaid. That's so much fun. I have, um, let me bring back the there's the hippo with a striped paper there. And then another sample I'm gonna pull from up ahead using the perched in a tree with the lines back there. This paper is just so much fun. Well, those were all available with a $50 order. Next, we're gonna move into some of the $100 order um, options. So the first one is amazing phrasing. This is a double stamp set, lots of stamps in here. A photopolymer stamp set that has 17 different words that you can mix and match to your your heart's content. So this first one has the you are amazing. Rewinding back to that rings of love, we have hey, I miss you. Here's another one I created. Um, I actually did two versions. <laughs> I remember that we did parakeet party and polished pink. Woohoo, you did it. Oh, I love these fun mix and match phrases. Last card using amazing phrasing. This one's from Karen Key. Um, who sent that one to me? I just think it's so beautiful with these colors. Starry Sky, Orchid Opulence, Bermuda Bay, and Parakeet Party. And then the contrasting white on black is just so stunning. Well, another option when you have a $100 order, unfortunately, the tree lot dies have sold out. But another option is the Wonderful World Bundle. Now, this one includes 12 by 12 designer paper and a stamp set that coordinates. Now, I feel like I've shown these over the last few weeks. So I'm, again, 
again, I'm moving through these pretty fast, but this is just sort of a recap and an inspiration to share some celebration project ideas with you. Here's a brand new card that I just got from Margot Richardson, a belated birthday card. I owe her one too. <laughs> um, so I love the color blocking that she's done here with the designer paper, three different patterns from the Wonderful World paper. And then this is an image from the same stamp set. A little dyeing on that white seam binding to customize it green. Just love that so much, Margo. Thank you so much for that beautiful card. Really showing off the elements in the bundle beautifully. Here's one from Bonnie O'Neill using a piece of the designer paper as the focal point and another piece over here with the painted texture embossing folder. Here's one from my mom, Susan LaCroix, using again a coordinating image and designer paper. Just so gorgeous. I love that the flowers in the wonderful world um, designer paper represent flowers from all over the world because Stampin' Up! is all over the world. We have demonstrators and stampers in Europe and the South Pacific and we're opening into new markets which I'm really excited about over in Europe. So exciting to share Stampin' Up! with the whole world. Here's one. This one's from Mary Ellen Stites. Again, combining the image from the stamp set and the designer paper so so beautifully oh I have to show you one more <laughs> I was trying to limit myself but I just love the way this card turned out with the little with the little pop-up and the matching imagery so this designer paper the pink one um, right here inside here uh, just so many different ways that you can use everything that coordinates all right well moving right along the host stamp set this is when you have an order over three hundred dollars you're going to get the perfect pomegranate stamp set i love the samples in the catalog but you know i haven't actually used the stamp set at all um all season and i don't have any swap samples using the perfect pomegranate so i'm so sorry i don't have any to <laughs> to inspire you but you will get this stamp set for free when you have a three hundred dollar order uh before next Wednesday, August 31st. Lastly, in this little brochure, we have a very special planner that you can get when you join my team as a Stampin' Up! demonstrator. The starter kit is $99 and includes $125 in product of your choice, plus this planner collection, which includes a 2022 July through December, plus all of 2023 calendar week and month at a glance, plus some extra planning pages, three notebooks, stickers, dividers, um, all kinds of note pages, and the Making Plans stamp set. This is such a beautiful collection. So if you've been thinking about joining as a demonstrator, definitely check out the links in the video description. I would love to chat more with you about this amazing opportunity to get the Making Plans collection. Well, as I mentioned in August, Stampin' Up! added some additional celebration items that you can get um, in addition to the ones that I just showed you. So free with the $50 order, you can choose the Timber embossing folder, the Gingham embossing folder, or the Seashells embossing folder. For a $50 order, you can also choose, or in, instead of the other things, the craft gift boxes in the silver foil um, 12 by 12 paper. So lots more options for the $50 level. And then at the $100 level, we have some die sets. So we've got the flowers of home dies. I meant to pull out some samples, but I didn't. I'm sorry. This, uh, this stamp set was in the January through June mini catalog carried over. So you'll find it in the annual catalog now. And that die set coordinates with the heart and home, um, set that is in the annual catalog. Then we have the dots and spots that I showed you on the hippo card. The daffodil dies coordinate with the daffodil delight um, stamp set. Again, that was in the January through June mini catalog. And then I am seriously shocked to see the Aspen tree dies, which are brand, brand new in the July through December catalog. So if you've been eyeing those, that is a steal to get for free with a hundred dollar order. Let me show you a few samples with the Aspen tree dies. Mom and I featured, um, the Aspen tree dies and the perched in a tree bundle in our recent Sunday stamping video. So here's the card that I'm um, again, I showed you that straight paper is also a celebration gift option. And then we've got the die cut trees, which are normally in an oval. And I cut them apart on this card and put a couple on the inside and then um, partial over here. This, this fat little bird is part of the perch in a tree stamp set that coordinates with the aspen tree dies. But the aspen tree dies stand beautifully on their own. You have this awesome frame with the trees and then some detailed um, leaf die cuts. 
this one with this distress gold and pool party. This is actually a case right from the catalog that I created inspired by the concept artist card. And lastly, this is the card that mom shared during Sunday stamping using the timber embossing folder. That's an option during celebration, as well as the aspen tree dies with the leaves. So, so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I hope that I've inspired you today with all of the celebration card samples that I have shared. There are so many amazing gift options and you can get them free with a qualifying order in my online store at juliedavison.com slash shop. Thanks so much for tuning in tonight. I'll be back next Thursday with a regular Facebook live and some brand new projects to share, but don't forget about that class on Tuesday night. Make sure to tune in Tuesday, August 30th over on YouTube at 7 p.m central time. Thanks again for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and were inspired by the cards that I shared and subscribe to my channel or like and follow me on Facebook so you don't miss out on future card making videos. Bye!